So I made this painting um, directly after I'd been by the Mile Lakes uh, just when they'd announced the lockdown and they, it was just before they shut the national parks and so my family and I fled to this campsite along the lakes while the world was in absolute havoc and we kept checking into the news yet it sort of seemed quite foreign in relation to being in nature and this beautiful still landscape. And so this work, and it's one of a series of works where it's almost a, um, a viewpoint. There's this sort of framing of this point in time. And essentially it's a point in time that's about you know COVID and more so about humans sort of coping with this big upheaval of their lives and fear and um, uncertainty, yet here is this still lake, this landscape, nature that is unaffected by, by this dismay that humans are experiencing. I think this, this collection um, for the fundraiser is actually quite important, especially at this point in time where the community are coming together in Newcastle, the artist community, the gallery who are facilitating this fundraiser are coming together to create um, an event and also a platform where artists, local artists can you know, show their work and potentially sell the work that supports not only the gallery but also supports the artists in this time. And that is you know, quite unique. During a time like this, I do think that art plays a vital role. Uh, it's a place where people can take solace, take respite and um, find a place outside of their, their everyday, which allows them to cope. It allows people to, art has helped people cope and go through difficult times um, for, you know, during wars, during, and music is a part of that, not just the visual arts, but music, performance. The visual arts in some cases has thrived during this time because people are seeking something other than what we are living through right now.